Roselle, I always get you laughing, don't I? Roselle, this is the third part of our interview. Okay, part three. Part three. And we're going to talk in this, uh, in this segment about uh, the different functions that you have. You have, you have we already did, we discussed the, their birthday parties, but you also have certain kind of nights. Yep, every month we have a ladies night, um, sometimes two in a month, and every month we also have a family fun night. And oh, we should say that this is for at Glazed, at what the address is? 184 Washington 184 Street. 184 Washington Street, where you can paint your own pottery. Correct. Okay. And so, uh, where can people find information about what time, what dates you have these, these ladies' nights? Everything's always posted on the website. It's www.glazedceramics.com. Mm -hmm. uh, we have an events page on the website, and I try to post at least um, one to two months ahead of time so people have plenty of time to plan. Mm -hmm. Uh, and also on Facebook, um, under Glaze Paint Your Own Pottery Studio. You can become a fan of that page, and all the events are always posted there as well. So, what can pe someone, uh, a group of ladies come in for ladies' mm -hmm. night, what can they expect? Because I think you mentioned to me massages. Yeah, yeah, we have a licensed massage therapist that comes in, um, and he is Joe Baldassano of A Tranquil Touch uh, Massage Studio, and he sets up his chair, and everybody is offered a chair massage, 10 to 15 minutes long. It feels like an hour. He's really good. It's a really great way to unwind, and they come back to their table, and all of a sudden the creative juices are really flowing because they... There's no charge for that? No, that's part of Ladies' that's Night. That's part of Ladies' yeah. Night. So they come down, you create a piece, mm -hmm. and you get a free massage. Yeah, absolutely, and some snacks too. What kind of snacks? We we'll do like cheese and crackers. Have some soft drinks available. And, this is uh, a no-brainer. Can what can lady, say? My wife, she has these in quotation marks uh, book nights with the ladies. Yeah. But they go out and they just, I think they just drink wine. Yeah. <laughs> so can can women can, can they come here and can they bring a bottle they of wine? They can bring in a bottle of wine. Absolutely. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, it just gets better and better. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and the, so we talked about ladies' night. Is there any other events? The family fun night is uh, is one of my favorites. It is a, a great way for families to get together, do something really unique and different uh, that's relatively low cost, and um, you, you have something to remember that night by. You know, you're not just doing an event and then have to, you know, just bring up the memory. You can actually bring out the bowl you made together that yeah. night and, and kind of um, bring up the memory Good that popcorn way. popcorn bowls? Yeah, well, you can make a bowl, uh, anything you want. Definitely, popcorn's a good one. That would be a cool one, right? Yeah. Because you know how you get around, like in your home, you have everybody yeah. gets out of the Movie popcorn night. bowl. Yeah. Movie night, yeah. All right, let's get up and let's walk around okay. and we can talk because uh, one of the things I noticed when I was walking around was my grandmother did ceramics when uh, you know when I was a kid, and she'd give us these figurines and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But uh, the ceramics that you have here are not your grandmother's ceramics. It's all kind of updated for the ninety, well, the two thousands, I guess you'd say now, yeah, right? Definitely, the the shapes are definitely more inventive, and what we try to focus on here is really functional items. Um, bowls uh, and, and mugs, and here this is a remote control holder for a Father's Day, ah, a pizza slice. I was trying to figure out what that was. <laughs> really. yeah, were... um, so uh, we like to, to focus on everything that can be really functional. All of this is earthenware. It's, um, it's fully food safe once it's glazed and fired. It can be put in the microwave and the dishwasher, and it's something you really can use every day, uh, something that you've created. That's like a schooner back there, the stein. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, these are every everything that we've seen so far is functional. Let's go over to the other. Uh, sure. I see you have a, a a pasta strainer over there. Yeah, absolutely. This is kind of our home goods section. We have a lot of things for the kitchen. You can design your own colander, and then once you rinse your berries or whatever, you don't have to put it away. You can something you can be proud and leave it out on the counter mm. as a showpiece. What would people put in these things right here with the corks on top? Really good for olive oil, especially like your my if you're like my family and you use a lot of olive oil that holds a nice amount. Keep it right on the counter and it's always handy. But you could put some red wine in there if you're having company and have a really nice decanter. Now you put the glaze on it, but the glaze doesn't go on the inside, does it? I, if it's something that's going to be food safe, I run everything through a clear coat. So in, in this case, I would put a funnel right in there and pour that clear so coat on the be, inside, okay. fully sealed inside and gotcha. out. Gotcha. Okay. And you have uh, you have pictures here. 
Yeah, oh, even your cooking utensils. Cooking utensils. Oh, the handles. You could so you yeah. could decorate. You could put someone's name on there. Yeah, another great Father's Day gift. What Dad wouldn't want is his own barbecue spatula that you know is designed by by his kids. Fantastic. Yep, barbecue spatula. They have a cracker and cheese. You paint all these things. Very cool. Very cool. Let's go over to the uh, what I think is the number should be if it is not the number one. I my drinkware. The drinkware. Margarita glasses, my uh, martini glasses, wine glasses, very popular uh, items, and it's uh, they make really nice gifts too, housewarming gifts or shower gifts. I'm picturing my wife come in here because she's a big margarita drinker. She's, she's going to sound like an alcoholic, but <laughs> by the time I'm done here, she's going to kill me. But no, no, like, you know, all the girls come in, they make their own margarita glasses, then they have a margarita party. Definitely, yeah. No we brainer. have a group that um, comes in uh, always together, the same group of four or five ladies, and they decided that after they, they had been in a few times that they would organize a potluck and at one of their houses, and everybody that brought something had to bring it in their ceramic piece that they painted here. So that not only did they have a nice potluck get together, they put it in their pieces they made, because sometimes you don't see other people's finished products, huh? so they could all see what, what each other had made. It was really a great idea. This is fantastic. All right, I'm going to pan around the room, and it's spacious, it's open, it's full of energy. Come down to Glazed. Address one more time. 184 Washington Street. 184 Washington Street. The hours are 11 to 9 p.m. Is that every day? That's Tuesday through Friday. We're open 11 to 4, Saturday and Sunday. Okay, Roselle, thank you so much. Thank you.